Today I'd like to talk to you about common logarithms or common logs. Common logarithms or as I mentioned common logs are very simply just a log base 10. Nothing more than that. It's just the log base 10. It's often written without the base written. Anytime you see a log without the base written um, you're dealing with a common logarithm. So there's no base right here. Uh, we're, it's going to be an implied common log. It's going to be an implied 10. With that implied, let's, uh, let's translate some of these into exponential form. Remember, if it's log base 10, it would be the same as saying 10 to the y equals x. If it's log base 10, it would be the same as saying 10 to the 0 equals 1. Not too surprising. Anything to the 0 power is 1. Uh, log base 10, remember there's a 10 right there, that's the 10 that's going to be our base, that's going to be our exponent, and that equals 10. Uh, likewise here we would have uh, log base 10, so remember there's a 10 right there, that's the 10 that's going to be our base, this is the n that's going to be our exponent, and this 10 to the n is what it equals. So it looks kind of redundant there, but really that's what we have going on. If we take a look at this one, remember that anytime you have a log of itself, so log base 10 of 10, you're dealing with a 1. So this is like saying um, n times 1 is n, or n equals n. So we can see how all of those things are quite true. What is the value of log 27? Well, in order to do this, we're going to look at it um, with our calculator. And our calculator should have a log button. Okay, should have a log button. That log button is a log base 10. Does not do other log bases more often than not, or at least they used to not. In, in the, the day and age of a lot of calculator apps and, and calculators that have lots of options to them, you can actually find ways to put log of any base into a calculator. But many calculators used to have only log base 10 and natural log, which we'll talk about in a later section. The log button on your calculator then is a common log. So if I have the log of 27, I can simply type in uh, log and then follow that with uh, a 2 and a 7. Okay and hit equals. So we'll point, type in log of 27 on our calculator and that should give us a 1.431. Now that we can start putting things into our calculator though it is kinda nice to look at some of the other things that we've discussed. If we look at log of 27 we could say well that 27 is a 3 cubed and our log properties say I could drop that exponent 3 down in front and I can now plug this into my calculator as well. And it should, since it started out as a log of 27, also equal 1.431. And if you take the time to punch that in on your calculator, you will find that that is true. I hope that this uh, helps you just feel comfortable with that log button, really, on your calculator. What does it mean? It cannot be used for any log. It's got to be used for a log base 10. But with change of base formulas and with... Uh, other log properties at our disposal, it becomes very useful. And we'll talk about that in some future videos.